represent the darker side, darker side, darker side, side. That's where I reside, I reside, side. Yo, I represent the darker side. Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, what up, squad? Welcome back to Hood Rock Entertainment, bro. You tapped in with your boy, Rock One. You already know what to do, man. Tap that subscribe button, hit the like button. You might as, well, might as well turn those notifications on, bro, so you can get the drop every time that I touch down on YouTube. You already know what's good, man. Hood Rock Entertainment's where we bring nothing but that street shit, um, underground rap, actually any rap now, bro. I forgot. I've opened the channel up. So, yeah, man, last week I um I decided to to step away from um from strictly doing um underground rap. And I thought I'd branch out and open it up to all types of music, sports, any kind of, any video, bro. Comedy, historic stuff, geography, whatever, bro. You send it in and I'll react to it. It doesn't have to be music, bro. But, yo, the other day I touched down in Nepal. And I'm telling you, bro, the Nip, bro, the Nepalis have got some dope-ass rap, bro. Like, I... I think I've reacted to two tracks now from out of there, and both fire, bro. So everyone's been hitting me in the comment section. Check that shit yourself, man. Everyone's been hitting me up for this unique poet. Um, 1994, the song's called. So, yo, the title here, even um, even the, the credits that say Origami Music Group, and that looks like 94, you know what I mean? So, yo, man, shout out to all of my Nepalis, um, Squad members, bro, everyone out there, much love to all of yous, bro, from New Zealand, from Hood Rock Entertainment. Bro, I'm glad that yous have tapped in with me, man, because it's just opened my eyes up to a whole bunch of rap that uh, I never even knew about, bro, to be honest. I had a friend from Nepal um, who I did a bit of, I spent a bit of time in prison with here in New Zealand. Um, his name was Mars. Um, and yeah, man. Cool dude, real down to earth, bro. Real um, humble and yeah, but wasn't afraid to get down. You know what I mean? He had a big heart, bro. He was a little dude, but pff, damn, he was always down to throw those hands. You know what I mean? So yo, it says something about the Nepal man, like about the Nepalis, bro. They're humble, very kind, from what I gathered, bro. Real giving, caring people. But don't get on the wrong side of them, bro, because they will fuck your ass up. <laughs> for real, for Well, I'm only speaking of the of my friend who could barely speak English, so he was really actually from Nepal. Um, and yeah, bro, that was his characters in that. Eh? That was his characteristics. His, his brothers and family seem the same. Whenever they come in to visit, they seem the same. You know what I mean? So, yo, shout out to all of you fellas, man. Shout out to all you... Ladies, gentlemen, kids, adults, whoever's watching, bro, over in Nepal, mad love to you, fellas, bro. Anyway, we're going to get it, bro. We ain't going to mess around no more. I've been talking for far too long. So, yo, strap yourselves in, bro. I think we've found the, the next up and coming, bro. So, like I said, Northeast India, I think their time to shine is, is now. Um, and, yo, by the sounds of things, Nepal ain't far behind, man. They're coming too, bro. And I'm here to bring that shit. So anyway, bro, enough of that. After this, bro, don't forget, like the video, head on over to the original, tap the like on that, and show the artist some love, bro. Yo, who rock entertainment to it's at least get it, bro. <laughs> Damn, he's even dressed like 1994. Yo. Oh, he's got a yo, I like his cap, bro. You know who that is, right? The um from Cuba. The revolutionary, yo. I just want to be better, better than who I was before. Yeah, what? And endeavor, that's my recipe for growth. Yeah, try to live with a yo, 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 yo. Hang on. And if you want to bring any change, it got to come from what? Come on, bro. I wasn't expecting that. Let me just look at something here. Damn. Damn. This has been, you know, because I don't like, I don't like um, minimizing the window, but, you know, this came out last year. Um, it says this came out last year around April. Um, yo, man, but I guess, because I was about to say that he, that it sounds like he, his style and the beat in there is from back in the days. 
but hello is because the song's called 1994 and that's why some of it's sort of in black and white and you know what I mean the songs I think it's meant to be giving you a, a visualization or a picture of what the of what 1994 was like in a rap scene Yo, this is dope. From within, so I woke up early in the morning with a message. You're either dead or dedicated in this path that you headed, yeah. Damn. And I'm speaking from the core of my heart. It's hard to live with the light without ignoring the dark. But God I try damn. my best because that's the only thing I can do. I like to thank you, Jermaine, for setting a good example. Every time I walk for- Yo, yo, and I've seen that these kids have got, um... We've got a whole bunch of other stuff too, bro, that I'm going to bring. This dude does unique poet. I'm going to bring more of his stuff because he's got a whole bunch of stuff here, bro. Yo. Well, what the fuck? I didn't even know any of this, man. Fire, bro. Fire, bro. Word up to the squad for sending this in, bro. Like, for real, for real. Um, I'm an 80s baby, bro. I was raised in the 80s and 90s, so this really touches home, brings back some memories, just the style and the beat. Yo. I tell myself I want to spread the same kind of vibe to the kids in the world. Finally come alive. Hope I still remain true to my, my authentic side. side. Yeah. Inspiration, motivation, motivation and action. And action. Living with the decisions I make driven by passion. passion. Yo, dope. I like how he's got the words up there. He's got the arms. Um, He's got subtitles on here, even though his English is really good. I don't sent, I can't sense an accent or anything, bro. His, his English is spot on, so, but cool. It lets us sing along to it, you know what I'm saying? I'm being driven by passion. I'm trying to do my own damn thing. Get to it. Yo. I'm trying to do my fucking job. Good job. Yo, this dude's bars are heavy, bro. Yo, man, we've been sleeping on the pile, bro, but we ain't no more, man. Well, I'm not. I'm here for this shit, bro. Send me in some more, squad. Send me in some more. And, yo, I do have, um, what's his name? I've got some coming up from, what's his name? Something Buddha? Something Buddha? I can't remember, bro, but I do have some coming up from another Nepal. Um, artist bro and yo man if, if this is what they're bringing i'm bringing you more bro i'm tapping into more surely there's more artists out there man i'm telling you has to be so yo if you want to check come and come tap yo hold on hold on come tap back in later and where are we yo here we go so yo this is what i'm talking about we've got coming up bro I'm not even lying, man. So the next one will be probably from. Damn, what the fuck's going on here? Yo, man, my internet's been playing up like a motherfucker lately. Oh, yeah. From this dude, bro. From um, Yamabuda. Yo, man, I got some from Yamabuda coming up and from Kunwa. From Kunwa Rebirth featuring Unique Poet. Yo, stay tapped in for that shit, bro. For real. <laughs> Yo, 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 I'm gonna run this back. I'm running this back a little bit more, bro. Yo, I'm glad too, because I got high before I watched this motherfucker, bro. So I'm high as fuck right now. I smoked a big fat blunt, and this is sounding dope as fuck. Every time I bump Forest Hills Drive, I tell myself I want to spread the same kind of vibe. Bars, bro. Finally come alive, but I still remain true to my authentic side. Motivation and action. The decisions I made driven by passion. I'm gone, trying to do my own damn thing. Mama, your son is grown. I'm trying to do my fucking job in partnership with God. Damn. 
Yo, man, who would have thought that these kinds of bars were coming out of Nepal, bro? Holy shit. So what was this crew? OMG? OMG is this crew? Yo, shout out OMG, bro. Shout out OMG. Um, let me know what that stands for too, bro. OMG. Yo. Damn. Over OMG over my grave, nigga. <laughs> on my on my gang. You know what I mean? Like, damn, it could mean a whole bunch of things, but let me know. Yo. OMG, what she say when she see us doing shit better than you? The underdog is now a wolf powerful. Howl at you. Damn, the underdog is now a wolf powerful. Howl at you. Damn. OMG, yeah, that's the crumb. Head to the top. Not enough room. Mm -hmm. OMG, what she say when she see us doing shit better than you? The underdog the dog is, is now a wolf powerful. Howl at you. How are you what I could do without a boy? This is dope, bro. This is fun. Easy, bro. Easy. This is fucking slick. So, everything about this track reminds me of 1994, to be honest with you, bro. So, 1994. Snoop Dogg had been out for about a year. He dropped Doggy Style in 1993. Um, you, you still had people like Public Enemy. You had people like Dilated Peoples. You had, um, you know, like those old groups, bro, Naughty by Nature, you know, those old groups like that. So, yo, man, this reminds me of um, like Digital Underground, stuff like that. But this here reminds me of old school um um, what are they called? Um, how can I forget? What the fuck they are, bro? Damn, I'm supposed to be a hip hop guru, but they remind me of Outcast. My bad, bro. And uh, sorry, Outcast. Shit, my bad, cuz. But yeah, they remind me of Outcast. Well, he does. This dude reminds me of Outcast. They, I don't know why I keep saying they, but yo, fire, bro. That's what I came in for, yo. Yo, and that's another one that got recommended too. Is it Carlo or Carlo 2.0? Love the way that ended, bro. Woo, woo, woo. Woo, woo. Hey, I'm loving this stuff coming out of Nepal, bro. I'm loving all the comments that you guys have been dropping, bro. You have been real good in the comments with dropping me um, information about the artists, about your fellas, um, about your fellas' culture, which um, I really like, bro. Because I'm, I'm, I'm a, I'm a very in touch with my culture too, bro. So like, I'm, I'm, I'm a traditionalist, bro. I like doing things, um. The way my old, the way my elders did it, bro. The way my ancestors used to do things. You know what I mean? I like touching down with my culture. I like getting really deep in it. So, yo, man, thanks for letting me know about your fellow's culture, bro, and sharing. Um, pretty dope, bro. Pretty dope to know that Nepal is on some on some hip hop shit, bro. And it sounds like you've been on this hip hop stuff for a minute, man. But we just haven't tapped in. So, yo, we got to apologize for that because my ignorant self. <laughs> never ever thought of nepali's rap bro until now so yo i'm here and i'm here to stay and i'm gonna keep bringing these motherfucker dope tracks so keep sending them in man hey you know what to do bro like the video head on over to the link i'll leave in the description box below show the artist some love even if you've seen it before just do it again anyway bro it helps run the numbers up and it's your way that you can support the artist as well bro so yo man this channel's all about getting behind the artists, bro, trying to expose new music from other countries. 
to the rest of the world. That's what I that's what I created the channel for. So I'm really happy that we're touched down in Nepal, bro. Shout out to everyone there. Mad love from New Zealand. Mad love from Hurok Entertainment. Yo, man, enjoy the rest of your day, yo. Tap back in for some more this afternoon, yo. I'm out. Peace.